So I have here some chicken thighs. I've already cleaned and pat them dry. I'm seasoning with some salt and pepper. And I'm also going to be adding some rainbow chili sauce to this. If you don't have the recipe for this, it is here and I'm going to link it below. It is one condiment that I think you really need to have in your fridge. Yes, it saves you a slice in them so they go in as well. Yes, I'm going to add about two teaspoons of virgin coconut oil. And once it is melted, I'm I have quite a lot of oil here in my pan, so I'm going to strain about three quarters of that. And then to the remaining, I'm going to add some chopped onions. This is about um, my rice, and I just poured a little bit here to help deglaze my pan. This is just going to help lift everything off the bottom. It's done cooking now, if I may call it so, and I've turned off the flame and I've added to it some rice. This is three cups of basmati rice that I've pre-washed. Add some salt and the rest of your chicken broth. So now I'm going to add in my peppers and give it a stir and that I'm going to just apply on top of and let's begin so you need some Roma tomatoes and I separate the seeds and the juice from the flesh we also need one green bell pepper one large red bell pepper we also need some scallions or green spring onions tomatoes I separated then got it and since they're into the fish I add some onion powder crushed black pepper some garlic powder and butcher the name this time if you agree please drop a comment I have always had a heart because mackerel is extremely fly um, fat content it is flavorful due to the ham caramelize your onions also today now after the onions and the peppers I add my and cook it for just about 20 seconds until they start texture if your blender is not powerful enough to do so then you must strain unless you don't add ingredients and add your bay leaves the bay leaf <laughs> now we're going to add some pop get that when you dehydrate your ingredients the flavors become more intensified better than the canned and when you give this recipe a shot make sure it is a huge batch because this recipe the top so after 30 minutes I love mackerel so besides grilling it, besides